Sex ed. In high school, it may have seemed like the scariest thing to come out of health class. But did you know in the U.S., not every state mandates sex ed, and many of them require uninclusive and dangerous topics be taught? According to the United Nations, the right to sexual education is a human right of sexual and reproductive freedom. Because of this, non-comprehensive sexual education is a violation of students' human rights. In the U.S., 29 states require abstinence or the choice to not have sex be stressed during sex ed. 19 states require the importance of abstaining until marriage is taught. Only 9 states, plus D.C., teach the importance of consent, and only 17 states, plus D.C., even talk about sexual orientation. However, 6 of those states require that homosexual relationships be shown in a negative light. So why are so many states lacking in comprehensive sex ed? Social stigma around sex has made it a taboo subject, but that's starting to change. A study shows that more than 93% of parents are supportive of inclusive, correct, and diverse sexual education in schools. Topics surveyed included puberty, healthy relationships, abstinence, sexually transmitted diseases, birth control, and sexual orientation. So, what can be done to fulfill our students' human rights? Speak up and let your school board know that you want inclusive sex ed. Donate or volunteer for organizations working to promote safe sex, such as Planned Parenthood. Call or email your local senator and let them know that you support inclusive sex ed in your state. How was your sex ed in school? Do you think you learned enough? Let us know in the comments.